Welcome. This is the energy vibration um, reading for the Gemini Sun Moon Horizon sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful shares. Uh, um, thank you so much. Um, please like and share these videos if this is your first time. Please subscribe. As we subscribe, then you will see exactly what is coming out. Okay. As I see, there's a lot of water energies um, that is coming in. But you I end the week on a very, very positive note. Um, there is so much that is going on for you, Geminis. I'm seeing the energy of two major arcana, which is good. These are your energies. You ladies, you Geminis, for, um, 45 years and older, you or this week is going to be affecting you guys. Whatever you have done, whatever the situation is, it's definitely going to affect you guys. The energy of the fool is here, which is the energy of the Aquarians. And here you are on Friday. Friday is going to be your best days. Okay, so you Gemini's Friday is going to be your best days. Now, the central of the week is the energy of the Tree of Cups. So there is going to be some celebration that is coming up for you, Geminis. So it's all about emotion and it's all about really positive emotions that is coming up. Please remember that this week begins from the 11th until the 17th. The energy the, um, energy of the week is an urge energy and the zodiac energy is here. So it's going to be a very positive. Um, and as you go from um, Thursday, Friday, Sunday it's going to be good it's a week of celebration for you Gemini's whatever is happening but for the latest 45 years and older it might not be not for all of you but these could be coming in if you're dealing with the Aquarians and the Librans um, that there is no celebration for them okay um, so be aware of who um, and this is why you should go and listen um, to the um, Aquarians and Gemini reading to see, especially for the latest 45 years and older. Now, as we look at Monday, we have uh, um, the energy of the Queen of Cups. So some of you on Monday is dealing with a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion Lady, 45 years and older. Now, this lady is dealing with uh, um, the King of Pentacles and whatever the situation is. Um, with these two people, um, there is going to be affecting your life. So you ladies, 45 years and older, could be in a relationship with this King of of Pentacles and what it is going to be transpiring is that there is going to be things that is happening some of you are going to decide to walk away from this relationship so let's say that um, the um, Queen of Cups and the King of Pentacles was in a relationship you are going to be realizing that it is better that you walk away from this relationship okay and you are going to be having a wonderful new start so Whoever these people are, it could come up if your mother is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, or your father is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, or whatever the situation is, they could be coming up in your reading. So some of you could be having situation to deal with with your parents in um, this um, month. Now, um, for the ladies who realize that um, you know there is somewhat a third party in your relationship, or the men. Um, you know as you decide to let go of this relationship a new love is going to be coming in and it's going to be good so it is a week of celebration where you're going to be ending and removing away from things okay so let's look at the queen of cups who is the queen of cups um this is who is the queen of cups she's very delusional she could be working with negative energies okay um whoever the queen of cups is very delusional she could be working with uh, um with um, energies negative energies so be aware and some of you are going to be finding that out okay so some of you are going to definitely be finding that out so um, this um, it could be your mom it could be um, it could be your sister it could be a, a, you know your 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 relationship with your friends or that sort of a thing but whoever she is she's very delusional so be aware of that um, the King of Pentacles is here, and you are going to be successful over this King of Pentacles, whoever it is. You are definitely going to be successful over this person, okay? This person could be also helping you guys to find a new place, a new home. You could be buying a new place or a new home. You could be starting your business with this King of Pentacles, okay? Now, you men, um, 
um, 45 years and older you could be connecting with this king of Pentacles to um, do business uh, which um, could be good um, in business um, so um, in business this could be good so you men could be connecting with this king of Pentacles in business or at work but it's more in business and uh, it will be a success now the Queen of Swords is in the reverse so you latest 45 years and older under the latest 45 years and older let's see what's happening your wishes and dreams um, could be coming out um, if someone else that is an air sign who have done you something else your wishes and dreams could be coming out some of you are going to be deciding to move on a new journey and leave the sadness behind and that is really good it is much better um, because some of you have been um, really um, dealing with some sadness for a very long time and you're going to be letting it go the sadness have to do with um, the sadness have to do with a Pisces a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn lady okay so you could be dealing with this um, uh, some sadness where um, you know you're leaving this behind because um, whatever the sadness was um, you're gonna go, gonna go forward and connect with a Pisces, a Taurus Virgo, or a Capricorn lady. Um, so there was there was some sadness in your life. Whatever the situation that has been happening to some of you it could be that you're leaving and going back towards your mom because you're so sad of what has transpired, and you're 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 trying to connect with this uh, lady. This lady is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. She's the, um, 45 years and older for some of you it is a friend for some of you it is um, 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 your mom for some of you it is someone who um, you know play is play as a special role in your life and you have been sad and you're going to leave your sadness behind and go towards this woman to see you know how she can help you or how you can release the sadness so okay so you have your two cards you have some challenge that is coming up with a new start um, with a relationship you ha definitely have some challenge that is coming up with a new start with a relationship okay so it's as if some of you are in a, a re relationship and there are um, a new relationship and there are really challenges and you're going to decide whether or not you're going to be staying in this relationship because there are so many challenges that is coming up with this relationship and you're going to decide you know does it really um, should I really stay in this relationship what with all these challenges and um, you're gonna decide hey you know maybe it's better that I leave this relationship but but whoever is starting a new relationship there's gonna be a lot of new uh, challenges coming up and you're going to be wondering uh, does it worth it should I stay with this person does it really work it does these challenges is this person really worth all these challenges that I'm going through and this is going to be um, for the people who are dealing with um, new relationships with all these challenges you're going to be asking yourself you know it, it, it does it worth it to stay in this relationship now the energy of the seven of cups is in the reverse for some of you are young ladies so you you long ladies uh, the opportunities are not there anymore so you long ladies between the ages of 17 um, 18 and um, 45 um, there is a, some um, real challenging situation you have gotten yourself in some real problems and um, there is no opportunities there is no opportunities that is coming up for you guys because whoever and whatever you have done um, um, you're being um, caught on and looked at now so um, whatever the situation is and it is best well good to really take um, a look at what you have done some of you have gotten yourself in a situation with um, a lady 45 years and older that is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and now you are left to fed yourself out of the situation okay because whatever you did for the slate the slate is standing away from you she doesn't know you she doesn't want to know you anymore and it's as if you um, find your way out of the situation okay um, you know some of you connected with this lady because you wanted to be in a family or 
um, to be around a family and they didn't really want you and you have done things um, and um, now they're standing back from you the ace of cup is here um, ace of cup is here um, this ace of cup is a new a, a sort of a love that is going to be coming in um, from um, it could be your father for some of you it could be um, in a relationship it could be um, the store is Virgo or Capricorn that is going to be coming in and is going to be giving you guys love okay this relationship is coming in for you guys as, as this man is a new is coming in and um, you're going to be it's going to be really um, a really promising relationship okay so it, it is a promising relationship and you have to communicate because um, communication is going to be the key between you and this person okay so for the people um, communication is just going to be um, the key between you and this um, um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man that is coming in this is an older person um, it could be your father there some of you could need some help and the energy of your father is coming in but this could be also a new love that is coming in for most of you guys because of a situation that has transpired the three of cups energy is victory over your um, victory over your enemies victory over your enemies and um, some of you and that is only some of you some of you your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true because some of you are going to be turning your back on your relationship and going towards uh, um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn lady okay it's as if this is where your love lies you're going to be turning your back and moving towards the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn lady because that is where your wishes and dreams lie okay so some success is um, going to be here okay The energy of um, the Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn is coming in. And you people, there is definitely um, some of you men, um, four to five years and older, could be having a really successful connection with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man. And this, this person is going to. Uh, this whatever you build with this man it's going to be a success so I can see that really coming up um, it's definitely going to be a success and um, whatever the situation is um, that is transpiring um, I'm seeing wonderful energies that is coming through so um, this is going to be good so some success is going to be coming out for some of these people so you know be careful and be aligned okay let's see what's card is coming up for you guys what cards are coming up for you guys this is card one and this is card two now with the energy with card one you have correct your mistake so some of you had made a mistake it could be that you have made a mistake in uh, taking on a relationship that wasn't for you um, being connected with someone that wasn't for you and you are going to be uh, releasing this person and moving towards um, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn lady okay so whatever the situation is and whatever that is transpiring um, a correction um, of your mistake is um, need to be made card two says um, grieve your loss correction of mistake grieve your loss okay and it's definitely the energy of the week for you guys because there has been some loss there has definitely been some loss that has transpired and that has happened there have, are definitely some loss that has been transpiring and happening to you and they are definitely saying grieve your loss and move on okay grieve your loss and move on and this is going to be good So, ladies and gent, ooh, ladies and gentlemen, I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back, and um, please like, share these videos, and namaste.